Sean, this uh, this Gus t said the uh, practice after you know the first day of classes wasn't very good. Have you seen a response since uh, that Tuesday workout? Yeah, I mean we uh, we definitely came back and responded. Uh, you know, today we got out there and banged around a little bit. And, uh, you know, I, I think we did pretty good, especially on offense. We came out and executed, and we were locked in today. He talked about looking for leadership roles. Have you seen more guys kind of stepping up in that role as leaders on offense? Yeah, uh, I myself, you know, has been trying to get more vocal. Uh, you know, there's, there's other guys uh, across the O-line that has been trying to step up and, you know, lead the guys and just be an example. Do you think you guys are any closer to finding that leader of the offensive line? Because I know at one point you described it as a democracy. Oh, uh, I mean, it's still, I mean, it, it, I feel like it's always going to be like that. Uh, you know, there are certain guys like, you know, Danzy, uh, myself, uh, you know, Avery, uh, guys that have more experience. You know, we, we kind of, you know, join in and kind of lead the guys on. And, you know, whether it's through drills or anything, you know, we kind of be examples for the younger guys. How impressed have you been with, with Mike Horton? We've heard that he's the, he's the backup right tackle right now. Yeah, he, he's, a, he's a very raw guy. Uh, I think, my, me personally, I think he's going to be a great player. Robert left. Excuse me. Is Robert left still working behind you? I'd left right. side. Yeah. yeah. How much has he improved since I mean, started last season? He's a guy that, that had a good spring. I mean, what do you see out of Robert? Uh, he has a lot of potential. He has the size. Uh, he's a strong guy. Uh, I think he he just has to put the weight on or whatever. But uh, you know, he he's starting to come into his own self. Uh, you know, he's starting to be more aware about the offense. Uh, he's starting to get. Uh, he, he's a big physical guy. So. He's going to be a pretty good player. It's not important what have you thought of some of the other freshmen. I mean, obviously, five of them come in, came in, and yet two that were here in the spring. Mm -hmm. uh, all those guys, man, uh, especially Mike, uh, you know, I, I, I feel like all those guys are coming in. Uh, you know, obviously, they, they need uh, uh, some time with Coach Russell to, you know, get adjusted to their bodies or whatever, getting stronger, getting faster, and everything. So I feel like all those guys that came in, uh, have some special going on in that future. What do you see between the two competitions at left guard and at center? Any separation there between the two guys at each spot? No, nah, man. Uh, you know, it's great competitions. Uh, you know, they're pretty much getting each other better. Uh, you know, all those guys that they're coming in, they're working hard, they're uh, paying attention to detail. And I feel like, uh, you know, I feel like all of them are, 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 have a chance to start. What are your thoughts on Jeremy as, as camp has kind of progressed and we're the game preparation here in week or so? He's starting to come into his own also. He's a, he's a big time leader for us. Uh, you know, we're very confident in him. We know that he's going to have a great season. Is it an adjustment to block for him? Because Nick was one, probably one of the quickest quarterbacks around. Is, there, is it different? Does I mean, it? obviously, you know, Jeremy's like more uh, pass pro quarterback. So, I mean, uh, you know, we're still going to do what we're going to do, but, you know, that's up to the coaches, how, however they adjust to things. Uh, I'm not sure, but, you know, we're still going to do what we're going to do. For, for you, how would you describe going up against Carl Lawson? Because we've heard that he's he's won a good bit of the battles against you and you and Avery kind of this, this camp. Is that, I said, do you not really like going up against them, or is it kind of like, well, I know he's making me better? I love going against them. <laughs> you know, we go head to head, man. Uh, you know, some days he gives me, some days I get him, but, you know, I love going against him. He's a guy. Uh, I mean, obviously, I think he's one of the best players in the country. Uh, you know, so me going against him, you know, helps me to work on, you know, quickness, speed. You know, he has true speed. So uh, every day I'm going against him. You know, it, I got to bring my A game. Tell us a little bit about the running game. There's a bunch of running backs <coughs> trying to get playing time. What have you seen out of them? Uh, all of those guys are doing great, man. Uh, you know, Javon, uh, Rob, all those guys, Peyton, all those guys, I think, uh, are going to be great players at that spot this year. We've heard the Cam Petway will, will hit people and uh, have some big time collisions. Do you ever hear them? I mean, I know you'll see him because he's behind you most of the time, but do you hear him and stuff? Yeah, I heard him one, one time, man. I had to look over my shoulder, like, what was that? But, uh, <laughs> yeah, man, he, he, he's a hard nosed hitter, man. He, he'll go in there, you know, he'll go for the knockout punch. So, you know, there's a guy that I like, he's very aggressive. Does that make a big difference in the run game to have H backs that are out there trying to knock people over? Yeah, they're they're a big time. They're they're very important in our offense. So 
He's going to have a great year this year. With Jeremy being more of a pocket passer as compared to Nick, do you feel any more pressure is playing left tackle, protecting the blind side? Not at all, man. Uh, you know, that's something I've been working on very hard all summer. Uh, you know, just getting back to the speed of the game, obviously, because uh, you know, we're going to be going against a lot of big time ends this year. So, uh, you know, just like going against Carl, I mean, he, going against him, and you know what I'm saying, is it, a way for me to get better on that note. What specifically about Jeremy gives you more confidence as the camp kind of progresses? Is it on the field or is it off making throws or is it off the field just kind of how he deals with, with teammates? Uh, everything, man, uh, on and off, uh, the way he deals with teammates, uh, you know, he's a guy that, you know, embraces everybody, uh, and on the field, you know, he's a guy that's out there being vocal, uh, making sure everybody do, everybody's doing everything right. He knows the offense like the back of his hand, so, uh, we're, we're very confident in him. Have you ever played basketball with him? Nah, nah, I ain't never played basketball with him, nah. We'll do one more. How, how competitive is the battle next to your left guard for that starting spot? Uh, very competitive. I mean, you know, you got two great players trying to get on the field, so, uh, you know, they're making each other better. Uh, whoever, I, I know whoever they put right there is, you know, is a guy that's going to uh, have my back, so uh, I'm confident in any one of them.